Hey, good morning, folks. And now here's a crazy thought for the morning. I don't know where some of these ideas come from. But have you noticed that they're wanting to build cars to be like horses? That's right. They're wanting to make our cars more like horses. And uh, first thought that comes to my mind is self-driving cars. Well, if you go back to the good old days, the intelligent horse was a self-driving horse, wasn't it? And I, I've seen this, I remember as a kid, you know, working out in the farm and the, the one farmer we knew had uh, a couple horses that would pull the hay wagons and all this. And uh, he'd just tell them to go down the end of the field, turn around and come back the other way. And they'd go down and turn around and come back. And believe it or not, when I was a little kid, I don't know, three or 45 years old, I remember this vividly, where my grandparents lived, they still had a horse-drawn milk wagon for Silverwood's Dairy. Silverwood's Dairy in London, Ontario. Horse-drawn milk wagon. And uh, the horse knew what to do. The guy'd get out with his basket of bottles and go up to one house and walk to the next house. And the horse would just go down the street to the next stop, stop there. and. He knew the routine, smart horse, and we're wanting to make our cars just like a horse. <laughs> and here's the other thing, we're wanting to make our fuel just like horse fuel. Horses just go out and they eat the grass, you know, and drink the water and their fuel up for the day. But we're wanting to use all this kind of biodegradable fuel for our vehicles now or, you know, electricity or biodegradable fuel. We don't want to use fossil fuel anymore. so. Wouldn't it be great to have a car that would run on grass and water? <laughs> Maybe that's the future. Maybe Elon Musk should be listening to this video. We need a car that will run on grass and water. So there you go, guys. Crazy thought for the day. We're building cars to make them like horses. Going back to the good old days.